The basic collar may be worn open or closed and has a 1 inch stand at the center back. And the width varies from 2.5 to 3 inches. So these are the required measurements for the collar. Measure front and back necklines from your patterns and record. For a clear demo, I will use my pattern blocks and trace the front and back necklines on a piece of paper. Measure first from center back neck until shoulder mark or notch and measure from shoulder mark or notch until the center front neck. And don't forget to record the measurements. Next, get a piece of paper and fold it in half. And square a horizontal line at the bottom part of your paper. And label this line A. From line A, mark up 3 inches or 7.6 centimeters. And label this mark B. From line A, continue on marking up 3 inches or 7.6 centimeters. And square in a line, and this is the line B. From folded line or center back, mark in the half of your neckline. In my case, it's 6 4 8 inches or 16.5 centimeters. And square in a line. And label this line C. From line A, mark up 1 to 8 inches or 3 centimeters for the stand. Label this mark D. From center back, mark in the half of your back neckline. Square a line and label this line E. This is the shoulder notch. From lines C and A, mark up for it of an inch or 1.2 centimeters. From this mark, draw in a semi curved line until E. From the mark, D, draw in a semi curve line till the mark at C, and this will be the roll line for the color. From C at line B, mark out 1 inch or 2.5 centimeters. And label this mark F. From F, mark up 2 eighths of an inch or 0.6 centimeter. From F, connect a diagonal line at the row line. And from the mark at F, draw a semi curve line until E. Label center back as on fold and draw in the green line label. Trace the roll line and line E or the shoulder notch. And cut out the pattern from your paper. And this is the pattern for the basic shirt collar. To adjust the collar, 
mark out two sets of one inch marks from shoulder notch towards the center back. And square in the slash lines towards the row line. And slash the lines. Next, spread the slash lines by 1 8 of an inch or 0.3 centimeters. And redraw the color to smoothen the line. And redraw the row line. Et voilà, so this is the basic shirt color.